first two centers. So you should be able to track your first two centers during inspection and also finish it in under five seconds or less. Here's two examples. So the first example, we have a line here and I'm doing white. So I also have these two other center here so that I can match with this like so. And also I see these two, so I quick I would quickly do like that, rotate, and see these two as well. And just bring over. Then I'm just finished. So the next one, I see that I've yellow here, and then the yellow here. So and then I remember the the white center, the placement. So I can just do like so and then rotate. There and there, join them up, insert like so. Next up, first three cross edges. On Yao, you have to be quick on this step. It's very hard to find pieces at first, but once you practice a lot, you'll eventually find quickly. So here's an example. Alright, so for this case, I see this green and white first, so I would just do it like so for that. And then I notice that these two white and orange, so I would do like so to match it up. And I know that orange should be here, should be placed here, so. And then I see this white, these two white and blue, so I can just do R2, U like so and I put it at the put it at opposite green. Third step, last four edges. You have to memorize the placement of the last four centers color and solve them without any hesitation. So here's another example. So right now I see that I've this bar of green and then I would just put it on the bottom and I have another bar green, so I would do like so. And then I know that this place should be red, so I immediately match up a bar of red to here, and then use these two to form a bar, and then place it down there. And this last one, like so. Next, last cross edge. Sometimes the last cross edge pieces can be difficult to be paired up instantly, but you can find those on YouTube. I'll link them in the description if you're willing to check it out. Here's two basic ones you should know. Fifth step, last eight edges. This is one of the most important steps in Yao method. You have to do it as quick as possible. Here's two examples. So, I see that I've this one here, so I would do a slice. But here we have two already done. So I would see this pair, I mean, I would see this piece and the corresponding piece is here, so in select so and then I see these two, this, this piece should be placed in there so instead of just rotating and insert this I would do a R prime U prime R to put it at the back and then see these two, so this one I would rotate like so and then I notice this two, so I would just select like so, slice, and then these two, slice back, then it's, it's soft. Next one, here I would possibly do like so, inserting these two, like that, and then this one is already placed correctly so I don't have to care about it and then I'm just gonna see this and this 
insert like that and then remembering this one this green and orange is here and then I quickly find the green and orange so the green and orange should be should be placed in here like so and then I notice that this red and green is here so I will just take it from the back and then here we have the yellow and blue so the yellow and blue is here so I would just put them in like that slice yellow and orange, yellow and orange insert like so slice back so final step Chibashi stage since your cross is already done now you only have to focus on your F2Ls and pray for no parodies So here are the two types of PL parodies. So this is opposite to each other. So what you do is the basic one. And next, this is adjacent to each other. So you should do is do a R U R prime U prime and then the out U prime R, U prime, R prime. Solve. 